What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Kamil. This is Gorilla Project Car. I fix cars in a barn like this one. And that's my Mark III GTI that I'm going to restore fully. Whatever. Today, <sighs> I'm fixing one of the worst paint jobs ever recorded in the human history. And that is my brother's Opel Astra H, I think. Why the paint looks like that, it's my fault. He let me train to paint the car because he had the problem where the paint flaked off near the door handles and he wanted me to repaint it. I actually proposed that. That was my first or second time ever painting and it came out terrible. The paint on the car looks like that because of something called dry paint and this happens when you have your paint gone too far from the panel you're painting. I learned that the hard way. I am I trained a little bit on the red panel for my Mark III GTI. I'll put the link to that video in the description. If you are following me on Instagram, you have seen me a couple of days ago carry black package um, and that was new paint gun delivered and uh, hopefully this time I'm gonna get great results when painting my brother's car. I don't wanna destroy that thing anymore. I just wanna finish it and let him enjoy it. I need wider lens. Okay, so that's new paint gun. Hopefully I'm gonna figure it out really quick. I also bought a couple of uh, sanding pads for my, for my tool. Where is it? Right now I'm going to start sanding the car, get rid of the door handles, then start sanding the car and hopefully prime it today. By the way, I'm recording two episodes today. I'm hoping you're gonna watch both of them. Subscribe to see another one and have that bell turned on so you'll get notified when it's coming out. Now I'm going to change real quick and go to the car and start sanding off the old paint that I messed up. And I'm back so I need to start doing stuff. By the way, at the beginning of this episode, I actually washed this car, but it wasn't really good wash. And if you want to see me wash car properly on self-service car wash, watch the video in the description or somewhere here. I don't know where I'm going to put it, but yeah, I did a video about that. I dropped a bolt inside the doors and I'm gonna have to take the door cards off the car of the door to reach it but that's problem for another day not today today I'm sanding and priming and that that's my priority I have plenty of time tomorrow and Sunday so yeah I'm gonna stupid mosquitoes I'm gonna take care of the most important stuff right now which is sanding What I'm using for sanding is my good old trusty Ryobi with new discs that I bought really cheap and match this thing. It's gonna be fun and it's gonna be quick which is the most important stuff.
it's probably gonna take another hour or two of sanding so I'm gonna catch you up on preparing for primer and opening new paint gun right now the car is sanded and I'm going to put the plastic over it tape it a little bit something something clean it and then prep it for primer and prepping for primer is relatively easy because it's only just dusting it off and degreasing for which I'm using thinner extraction I don't know as you can see it's dark outside and I don't want to be too loud after 10 p.m. because it's illegal and I have respect for neighbors so I need to hurry up Now I have to tape it all to the body so it's not going anywhere. So what I did now was take the microfiber towel take the dust of the panels and then get them get the ones over with scotch bright to get every like part i need to scuffed a little bit and right now what i'm going to do is get it with microfiber again to get that dust off and then degrease it after which new paint gun Okay, <laughs> I primed the car first time with new paint gun and it's amazing. Before my spray pattern was like a dot, like a circle. And right now I have a straight line, brilliant settings. I'm so happy with the purchase that I did. Get yourself paint gun if it doesn't, if, it, if you need one and painting suddenly became fun but right now it is primed I, mean, I need to give it around two hours before i can sand it and prepare for a uh, base coat so i can't do anything right now with the car hence i'm going to do something on the yard which i'm not going to record because this is about car painting Don't ask. All right, I did wait maybe not full two hours, but somewhere two-ish hours. I took off the masking tape and right now I'm going to sand that smooth with 800 grit sandpaper, after which I'm going to paint it with base and then clear. You may wonder why I am sanding freshly painted surface. It's because of mechanical bonding that needs to happen between primer and base coat. Um, I'm gonna make fine scratches with 800 grit. They won't show through base coat, but they're um, aggressive enough that the base will stick to it. So I need to do it, whether I want it or not. As you can probably see, 
there are there's new tape on the panel which means it's sanded it's degreased and it's taped now I'm going to degrease it again mix some base and paint it I sprayed base right now and I can already tell that I'm going to have to repaint the doors. Yeah, I'm painting doors. Which doors? Rear doors because the paint is... Uh, I don't know even how to call it. I'm gonna have to google that thing. Why it happens? What can I do? Etc. Front doors, however, are kinda good enough. I hope not to mess clear coat on front doors, that way I, I only, only need to respray rear ones. I have paint but I have no time because my brother needs this car for daily use and I can f have fun with it only during the weekend. So I cleaned the gun, it's ready, I'm waiting a little bit more, let's say 5 to 10 minutes and I'm gonna go ahead and clear coat both doors. If anybody knows why this happened, let me know in the comments below. I degreased, I degreased the hell out of the doors. I don't know why this happened. Let me know. Help me. I messed it again. Okay, so I am not a professional painter. I am not even a painter. <sighs> I'm just learning and this car has defeated me for the second time. I'm going to do what every normal person would do. I'm going to educate more, repeat that and fucking nail this paint job. I'm not giving up, that's just the beginning. And this means war, that I'm going to win. win. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Okay, this car has won two battles. But I'm going to win the war. So, you may ask, why are you so furious? Because... First of all, Paint started flaking off here as well. Second of all, oh my god, this looks terrible. I wanted to say that I got paint runs right here, but this is super bad. And I messed it up so bad that I next time I'm going to have to paint like lower parts of the doors as well. No, but that doesn't matter because every time you mess something up you learn how to fix it and how to not repeat that mistakes in the future if you're still here i appreciate it a lot subscribe to the channel like the video and let me know what can i do to make it to make my painting better because you can see that i really need your help stay safe hydrated have fun and bye